guys welcome back to my channel still in my countryside journal editions to be healthy and to keep fit is very important during this pandemic so every weekend i love to walk in the nature in this episode I'm walking in nearby river and as a bonus, I got to see the ancient water mill's house. And the best part of it, it's still working well. But I will save the best for last. Now, let's enjoy this beautiful river. The water is pretty clean. And I admit, I really love to hear the water flow. It's really calming. Mm, with that sound, you let your worries and stress go down to the street. Hear this. In Pieve Bosciana, the small town in northern part of Tuscany, Italy, I found an ancient water mill that is still function in these modern days, which mostly generated by fuels or electricity. Instead, this medieval mill is generated by water of Esauro Creek. Here I am at this traditional mill house that is belongs to the Regoli Ercolano family. The house is surrounded by beautiful garden and a farm of chicken and veggies. It's very colorful and lovely place in summer. Beside is the Regoli is also love to make a bonsai. Nearby, there is Madonna Chapel. Tiny but pretty. Now let's go inside. And don't forget to sanitize. Wow, look at this stone grinder. Seems very sturdy. During our visit after the walk, Mr. Regoli shows us the mice is being ground with the water mill, which came from the force of water driving the stone grinder, and that is so amazing. I have to tell you, the couple owner is very friendly and welcoming. He is also very patient explaining on how the water mills work. In this mill house, they have four grinding areas. This is the first one. The second one. 
second one. for greening corn that is very special from this place as it have it rose local call it for menton autophile so you know this is the picture of it the mills also can be used for grinding chestnut to make a chestnut flower this particular place Especially in Garvanyana Valley, chestnut grows everywhere. Before the COVID hit, chestnut festival is held every year in Kashio, under the Komune of Molatsana. Krisyolite is the name of the festival. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. Mr. Regoli say that this meal was built in 1700 that is more than three centuries ago and passed to so many generations very interesting right if you guys love polenta the mice from here is the best to make for it mm, the thought of it make me hungry Gotta go home guys, see you in my next video, stay healthy, ciao ciao!